give your indulgence to sing Please the glory sing. of God in my mother's tongue. Yes, you can. Praise sing. the Lord. Calvary saw me, daughter. Iba nu jemi ti fulo. Bobo mi jemi ni jesu no kuro. Calvary saw me, daughter. Calvary saw me, daughter. Iba nu jemi ti fulo. Bobo mi jemi ni jesu no kuro. Calvary saw me, daughter. Please permit me to interpret. Please do. It means Calvary revitalized me. Hmm. My sorrow has departed. All my tears, Jesus wiped them away. Calvary revitalized me. Hmm. Chosen praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father. I am Brother Akeola Agbaji. My maiden encounter with this great God was on the 5th of February during the program Christine from Sorrow to Joy. That first experience was so captivating that after that experience, I decided to pitch my tent with this great God of Chosen. Mm. Thank you, Father. What year was that? And from that moment going forward, it's been a plethora of blessings and favor and miracles to the glory of God. Chosen praise the Lord. Hallelujah. First and foremost, I thank God and I appreciate God for my priceless salvation. Mm. I give God praise. Mm. Thank you, Father. Secondly, my testimony is about how God delivered me from a mysterious ailment. I noticed after the lockdown was lifted my body system wasn't the same again at first i thought it was because i was doing regular uh, workout and i was controlling my diet but when people started asking me brother what he let be what has happened to you why are you looking like this i knew something was seriously wrong before I knew it had lost about 40 kg. Hmm. I came down from about 100 and something kg to about 60 something kg. Hmm. I paid regular visit to my doctor, my personal physician, but I was coming all the time. I was praying though, I was praying, but I didn't want to leave anything to chance. In fact, my uh, doctor got so tired that he said, Aki, can we run a cancer test? I said, not me and you i choose to believe god so it went on and on and on in fact somebody approached me and told me that what is wrong with you i said ah it was regular workout he said brother this is more than regular workout and diet whatever you are doing please cease from that thing the way you are looking is terrible and in fact i was looking about 15 20 years above my age so i came coming to this i i kept coming to the service just that like, like our pastor will say continuity brings freedom so i continued in the service and one day the our go spotted the case he said that person people are asking you what has happened to you because of the affliction of the wicked one he said i command the yoke to be broken and i return the arrow back to sender not long after i discovered that people that were telling me that i was losing so much weight i was looking so old now started telling me you are putting on so much flesh mm. and you are shining <laughs> i want to give god the glory. thank you god of choosing thank you father my second testimony is about the road that blows up the end of all strife in 2010 our geo preached a special message in a crusade precisely 25th and 26th 2010 it was the first of its kind and since then he has never repeated that message the rod that blows on the end of all strife the scriptures in his preaching minister to me personally you know there's a message that goes to the general crowd there is a rema that will come to you in person i received my personal rema that day 
I remember he quoted from Numbers 17, from verses 1 to 8. And I'm particularly, I was particularly interested in verse 5, which says, It shall come to pass that the, the man's word that I, like, I will choose shall blossom, and I will, bring, I, will, I will cause to cease from you the murmurings of the children of Israel. It was a test that proved that uh, Moses was actually anointed and chosen by God among the children of Israel. You know, as they say, divine revelation is the precursor to divine revolution. That message revolutionized my life. That anytime there is opposition, anytime there is competition, anytime there is insurmountable mountain, I would declare that I'm the chosen man. God has chosen me and has made my road to blossom and God will turn the situation around in so many areas particularly in my business it happened not once not twice but I will just give two testimonies I'm into real estate by the grace of God and there was a particular property a mega property indeed that so many estate agents have tried to market to no avail for about nine years according to the owner of that property so god revealed to me before any breakthrough god will always reveal to me so that i will stand on his word i will stand on that revelation and i will stand on the fact that the word that blossom has brought an end to every strife so um when that pro when i was told about that property uh and god showed it to me in the dream i started lifting up before god professing the word of god according to isaiah 46 10 that it has he has declared the end from the beginning from ancient times the things that are not yet done that because he has revealed to me he will bring it to pass because he has said it he will bring it to pass because he has proposed it god will do it so after that revelation i noticed that somebody actually paid for that property somebody paid some deposit for a substantial amount for that property and i when i discovered this i reminded god at first i didn't want to fight it spiritually i mean uh, but when I realized that it was somebody I told about that property, I gave all the information, went around to sideline me and use that information to its advantage. And I called on God. I went to the altar of God of choosing in my branch. And I told God, remember, you slowed down the children of Israel and the children, the Egyptians, when they were after the children of Israel, they were not able to catch up with them until the crossover. I said, God, give me divine speed until i get a client that will pay for this property nobody is selling that property and the god of choosing granted that request my my client paid today paid the entire amount not deposit by the following day this person, same person that sidelined me was ready with his with his own balance to show you that god has chosen his is choosing want and it has caused the uh, the, 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 the rod to bosom praise the lord hallelujah the second one was another one that like us to clap on to god of choosing the second one among many others was the one that has been in the market for over 12 years hmm. and god also revealed to me that i sold that property but meanwhile so many people have been going around with the documents and everything meeting the owner but i met the owner at the later stage praise the lord hallelujah um when i met the owner the owner is resident in the u.s called we, called, we spoke on phone and gave me the mandate the person that was supposed to buy that had discussed with me refused to come up then the pastor came with the word of knowledge he said this man will have a property to sell regardless of what is going on in the in the in the nation i am telling you you will sell that property mm. i claimed it another word of knowledge came from my pastor he said that property the people are hesitant and in fact the person who wanted to buy was hesitant about buying again he said the people that want to buy that property they are hesitant about it but i'm telling you they will come with speed this client that i've been calling several times decided to call me i sent so many messages so many texts I tried to call he didn't reply now came to me and now told me that it would be very sad if you miss buying that property so that's how god intervened 
the, the bottom of it is that God has always proved the word that proceeds from the mouth of his servant. That word cannot return void. That word must accomplish that which it pleases. Praise the Lord. It, it was as if he was following the, 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 uh, the transaction bumper by bumper. Giving word of knowledge at every stage. I don't want to go into so many details because the testimony interviewer said I should be snappy. So it's just anytime, anywhere, God will always prove that He has chosen us as choosing because that was my take home from that uh, from that crusade in twenty in twenty ten, twenty fifth, and twenty sixth. My take home was that I am a choosing man, and where competition is involved, where trials, where there, there is. Uh, uh, so much opposition that God will always prove the one he has chosen and he will put an end to every strife chosen praise the Lord Hallelujah. Let me stop here. so you mean now that that property that couldn't be sold for 12 years until it came to you Sorry? now the property was not able to be sold for the yes. past 12 years the first one was for 9 years the first one was 9 years the first one was and for pastor gave word of knowledge let me start from the 12 years on the last one after pastor gave word of knowledge yes, that though the buyer is, is is hesitating from buying he gave word of knowledge that the person will buy yeah. eventually that person bought that property yes thank you god of choosing let's clap onto him thank you father at this stage i want to pray for my pastor the word of God says in the book of Isaiah chapter 46 verse 13 He said I will bring near my righteousness it shall not tarry my salvation I will bring there my righteousness it shall not be far off my salvation will not tarry that which the chosen ones have been waiting for that special miracle it will not tarry in Jesus name Amen uh, John the apostle said in the book of Acts chapter 27 verse 5 He said I believe God It shall be as I was told It shall be as the prophecy has gone forth in Jesus name Amen. Jesus, praise the Lord Let's clap unto God of choosing Let's appreciate him Thank you Father Thank you God of choosing Having had testimonies of what God of choosing has done I want to assure you that God of choosing will fix 